everybody, Mike with Skipper Buds. I want to take a few moments to go through this beautiful 2022 53 Tierra Coupe. This is hull number 63. This boat is 54 feet, six inches overall, 15 foot 11 beam. Draft fully loaded is four feet, three inches. Um, average dry weight is about 43,000 pounds. Beautiful boat. This is in Lauderdale blue. This one we did do a teak swim platform, nautical structures. You can see the area, the four areas where the chalks are inserted. Underwater lights, I don't know if you can see them here in the video, but they will rotate through colors. Once you find a color you enjoy, you just flip the switch on and off, and it will stay at that color. Back here, Kenyan grill, refrigerator, it's a drawer refrigerator. Large storage area, hatch here. See where the buttons are located right here. Quite spacious, quite large here. See these baskets for draining your uh, or dry, drying your lines, excuse me. Those are the chalks. That is the forward cover to uh cover the windshield. These bars here, they attach here and to the top of the make fast sunshade just for some extra support. Also back here we have the swim platform. You'll see the underwater lights here in just a second to reflect off the back portion of this. There you go. It's 1,200 pound capacity for a dinghy or a jet ski. Back up. Nothing better than a look of wet teak. And then as you bring this up, you want to make sure that you uh, you feel the click. So as it comes all the way in, there it is. Dual entry on the 53. Here you've got your 50 amp cord, Glen Denning. Nice walk arounds, both sides. Half facing seats. It's always beautiful table. Table is power, it does go up and down. A lot of folks ask me, what is this? That is an adapter so you can insert a television on a pole for back here. Just look how beefy that hardware is. Here is your second joystick for piloting the boat or docking the boat here from the, uh, from the aft. Fusion stereo. It's zoned, so different zones of the boat you can control with different uh, head units like that. These ottomans are great. If you lift the top, there's a little backrest that flips out of it. Beautiful day here in Winthrop Harbor, Illinois. New feature for 2020, late 2021 and 2022, screen door. Phantom screens. Designed a screen for the 53 coupe here. Beautiful option. Here's the galley. I love the countertops on this boat. Double cabinetry. Sinks. Convection oven. And yes, 
It has a garbage disposal. Here, your battery and generator switches, shore power and shore power. Refrigerator freezers, additional cabinetry, wine chiller. This is the TV in the up position. The button for that is located underneath the helm seat. It's a little arrow up, a little arrow down. Underneath this seat is the main distribution panel. Beautiful boat. They did a great job on the interior of this. And as always, the wood, the teak in here, and the new lighter beech wood, absolutely stunning. Critical match teak. You can see all the lines match up. The flooring is absolutely stunning. at the helm. This does have a sea keeper. The dash is really not uh, flickering like that. It's the refresh rate on my camera. This has the IPS 950s. This seat is in the forward facing position. It can, by pulling this strap, it slides on these chrome or these stainless steel tracks here. And then the seat will be part of the conversation and the backrest flips this way. So it'll either be in a U formation or it'll be in this forward facing. see forward, forward sun pad, the remote spotlight, monstrous windshield wipers. The VIP berth, these beds do get pushed together and connect to create one berth. It's three stateroom, two dry head. Let's see if we can. There we go. A little better angle. Very roomy. Here's the third stateroom, bunk room. Television, storage. While we're up here, I'll show you the uh, hanging locker. Cedar lined, you can see all the linens are still wrapped. This boat has been in our custody three days. Right now has just, um, we brought it here via water from Holland. Um, and it was put together in Holland by the factory. So boat has nine hours on it right now. Moving aft into the master. Once again, look at that floor. Look how beautiful the floor is. When you do the third stateroom option, you lose a stackable washer dryer, but I think it's worth it. And here, you go to a combo unit, washer dryer. Tons of storage. Screens for uh, the side windows here. And some crosshair ventilation. As always, Tierra doesn't waste any storage. Underneath the bed here, the master, this is all storage. You have to have your Tierra logoed 
life jackets. And here's your hanging locker for the master. There's the TV that goes in the back cockpit. That's where it stows. Here is a look into the master head. Very roomy shower. Once again, beautiful teak throughout. Beechwood, the gray is the beechwood. I really like the use of all the colors. So not only is this an absolutely gorgeous boat, but it is a monster on the lake. IPS 950s. top end just about 40 miles an hour go in anything be comfortable this is quite the vessel thanks for taking the time to watch come out to north point winter Harbor, illinois skipper buds come take a look at some tiras